Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to use the free building generator, the Beautify in Blender to create any types of the 3D buildings with any quantity of the story and export it as a game ready FBX with just a single mesh. Import into Unreal Engine 5.1, set the collision setting properly to make the player avatar able to interact with the, the building generated. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step. First, you may just go to go to my, my video description there to get the beautified for your blender. And also get the blender, you need to install the blender in your computer. If you already download the beautified, it is a zip file, a zip folder, you have to right click and extract it into your computer. Once you already extracted, you can see a blend file is there. If you already install the blender, then if you double click it, it is also automatic open by using the blender. To start this, you have to click plus and then choose the general to create a new layout. Then scroll. This is the blender right now. Next, you have to click here the viewport shading so that you can view all the colors. Next, I'm going to show you how to change the shape of this building. First, you have to click here, click the wrench. Maximum number of the floor is seven floor. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You can see. If you modify it, let's say you put it 100, it is going to become a 100 floor apartments. Let's say if I put 25, it is going to have 25 story just like this next I'm going to show you how to change the shape you have to to switch from the object mode to edit mode change it to edit mode then you click the movement next you, you can select the vertices you only select the bottom let's say if you select the, the vertices then you can click any of the vertices, then you can adjust the location of the vertices. Right, now you can see. Let's say if you select the edge, then you can select any of the edge that, that you want. This is an edge. Then this is another edge. Okay, this one. Wait. If you want to select, you have to select at the X and Y plane. Do not go and select the, the Z plane. If you select the Z plane, you will spoil everything. You see? Just control Z. Now, let's say I want to select these vertices, then I click here, select these vertices to pull it out. It is up to you to design any of the shape of this building. See? Here, there's another vertices. Can be any shape. Once you feel satisfied already, next, you are going to design the color. First, you start from here, click, click this. Then, this is the base color. First is the ground floor wall. Change the color, like this. Change the base color. Just now is the darkness. Then here is the color. Next, you are going to choose the wall. This ground floor pillar, if you change the color, which color is get changed? Not the surface color. You have to change the base color. Next, you, you scroll down. It's the rooftop. Rooftop actually is the base. The building base. Click here to change the color. It is just simple like this. Next is the wall color. The wall color should be here. You can just try it. No, not this. 
the middle floor wall alright this is the one you can change the color from here change to any of the building color that you want let's say if you want to have a pink color building just like this next is here the trim not this the window the window is the roof window glass you can change the color at here make it blue it is up to you it can be any color Green as well, light blue. Once you feel satisfied already, you are going to export it as FBX for your iClone 8 3D animation software. But you have to follow certain steps. You cannot direct export as FBX file. No, don't don't export in this way because if you export in this way, you will spoil everything. And also. First step, you have to export as OBZ. You have to choose the wavefront OBZ. Do not choose the legacy OBZ. The only way, the next step is export as OBZ. But before that, just save it as a new project first. I create a new folder, name this as building04. It is up to you to name it as any name. Save this Blender project first. Click File, Save As, then save it. On my desktop, the building 04. Here, I name this as building 04 as well. Next, you have to export as OBJ. OBJ, click file, export OBJ. inside this folder export as obj next close this project file then open the blender import the obj once you open the blender just delete everything delete the camera delete the cube and also delete the light then click here file import the obj Wavefront OBJ from this folder, Control C to copy and paste it here, Control V and press enter. Import this OBJ file and wait for a while. Once you import it already, the next step, what you are going to do is just combine all the multiple mesh into just a single mesh. Now you can see this is multiple meshes. We are going to combine it to become a single mesh. Click the first one, scroll down. Hold the shift button, click the last one, then all will get selected. You have to press Ctrl J. Then all of this it combine into just a single mesh. Just double click it, name this as building 04. This is a single mesh. Next, export as FBX. Right click to create a new folder, 02 FBX. Then click file import sorry export as fbx for this time everything will be okay copy paste enter now export as fbx i will name this as building 04 the path mode you have to choose copy then select it to make sure all of the materials were embedded inside the fbx click export Where is it? Let's wait for a while. Now everything done, it exported as FBX file already. Then for this, at this moment, I can close this Blender project and I don't save. Next, we are going to import this FBX file into Unreal Engine. So first I'm going to start the Unreal Editor
Now the Unreal Editor is loading. Now as demo, I'm going to create a fresh new game project here. I will choose a third person, a third person game project, and the project name is my project 13. I click create. Now the Android editor is loading a fresh new game project from here. Just wait for a while. Next, we are going to import the FBX file into Unreal Engine 5.1 game project. First, I'm going to, to create a new folder here. Right click, new folder. Name this folder as building 04. Then, import the building 04. Just drag and drop. This is the FBX import option. Just click import all. Now, it already successfully imported into the Unreal Engine. Next, it is preparing the shaders. So of course now, if you try to open it, you cannot see any of the materials. Now, it is still loading. So you can see all of the material is not yet shown. The preparing shader, you have to wait until it, it all 100% here but it's okay I can just double click to open and set the collision first just scroll down under the collision setting the collision complexity use the complex collision as simple you have to switch it to here next click save and close now if you drag and drop into the game scene here try to play you can see your player avatar now can interact with this building already it really have the proper collision and it is really up to scale and look at the whole building it is really up to scale now the shader already well prepared. You can see all of the shaders. Now I'm going to move this building to the side. Try it this way. Play. I'm going to test the collision setting.
can see the collision is okay there's no penetrations between the 3D models right so in this tutorial I really successfully show you how to use the free building generator the beautify to create any of the 3D buildings any amount of the story and export as FBX a game ready FBX then import into Unreal Engine 5.1 with the proper collision setting that the player avatar can interact with the building in in your Unreal Engine 5.1 game project and that's all for today thank you for watching if you love my video tutorials and sharing if you feel all these tutorials and sharings are very helpful to your 3D modeling 3D animation and 3D game developing you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorials or sharing you receive a notification immediately see you in my next video enjoy happy 3D modeling 3D animation and 3D game developing see you